everybody, and welcome back to uh, Slay the Princess, the pristine cut. Uh, last time we uh, did that, actually, um, uh, once, and then we we tried it again and, and messed that up. But we're about to we're about to go do it again, dude. Freaking <laughs> playing a game where the only objective is to kill women. <laughs> God, let's proceed. Let's get in there and do this. The interior okay, of the cabin never mind. Is suffocatingly tight, more of a glorified tunnel than a building. Its stone walls squeeze against your sides, leaving you no choice but to press forward. The only furniture of note is an iron altar jutting out from the wall, a pristine blade perched on its edge. Yeah, 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 we know. What's with the mirror, though? The blade is your implement. You'll need it if you're going to do this right. See? We have See, we've had it, though. Space than before. <laughs> and we've we still done it wrong. She'll kill us. <laughs> and the only space is out there. <laughs> okay. Take well, it. Well, shit. We're gonna have to kite her around the building. <laughs> uh, you never mentioned the mirror. That damn mirror's back. But there's nowhere... No way forward. There's a mirror at the end of the room, and that's it. Take the blade. We're gonna take the blade before we uh, do anything else here. It would be difficult to slay the princess and save the world without a weapon. And now but we gotta stab the no mirror. Her without it, we need every part of us to survive, and that steel claw is as much a part of us as any. Okay. You never mentioned the mirror. Maybe it'll go away again. For something to go away, it would have to be there to begin with. And let me assure you, there's no mirror here. The only thing at the end of the room is the door to the basement. This fucking guy, dude, he had no idea what's going on. I can't believe this. Mirror or not, we need to be there. The why we pick doesn't matter. I agree with the freak. Let's get a move on already. And worst comes to worst, we can smash it. True enough. Let's get it. You step forward and approach the door to the basement hesitating before you open it as if you don't see it you're rather committed <laughs> to the bit aren't you the door's right there it's right in front of you bruh this really is just like last time has there ever been a game that just has like a like a shitty narrator that doesn't know what's going on I'm trying to think of something but it's like but usually it's the complete opposite where the narrator is like all knowing and and you know that's kind of the point and that's been played to parody with like things like the stanley parable and whatnot but i don't think i've seen it go the other way per se where it's just like the the narrator has no clue what's happening <laughs> uh this is just like it last time baby yet it's still there uh, let's wipe it. You reach forward and okay, drag cool. your hand across the door leading to the basement. As if on command, it slowly slides open, scraping against the floor as it reveals the dim path ahead. Okay, well, who knows what the fuck that mirror well, I'm is. I'm not surprised. But we're here it to was do in a our job. Way, and now it's not. That's all that matters. Before you is what may as well be a sheer cliff face. There are enough footholds that you'll be able to clamber your way to the bottom, but it will require careful effort. That's fine, I'm not in control. Yeah, hissing up from below. <laughs> Imagine it just throws Q like QTEs at you <laughs> locked in close and get out of nowhere. If the princess lives here, slaying her is probably doing her a favor. Her voice, bold and fierce and impatient, echoes from the chamber below. All right, we get a first taste of this one. Do you have more fight in you than last time? That was such a disappointing show. I know you can do better than that. Okay, well, you know what? I tried my best, and that's all I can do. Go to her. Rile her up. If she's angry, she'll make mistakes. True. Ooh. Are we talking shit? You want to fight? Then how about you come get one? I know you can't get out of here on your own. Are you sure you still want to fight? Uh, I'm gonna get it, bitch. That's not how this works. I'm all chained up, remember? How about you come down here and fight me? How about I just let you starve? 
like like let's play the waiting game on this those chains were <laughs> nothing to her last time true and there'll be nothing to her this time but we need to show ourselves first to make her boil over fine by me just tell her uh you're just like your mother that'll piss her off for sure guaranteed Continue the basement landing. You've nowhere to go but down. You start the difficult journey, gripping the stone, lowering yourself foot by grueling foot. But soon, there is solid ground beneath you. I was like, how deep is this freaking cabin? Every crack and crevice will need to be faster than her. True. You turn to face what oh, lies she hasn't at the end of the narrow tunnel. The princess, imposing and tightly muscled, grins back at you from the darkness oh is because we actually didn't kill her like we didn't actually manage to kill her we just died so only we reset oh that's interesting her face okay. widens into a broad grin it was already like that bro there you are knife in hand how thrilling and she's Attack not even me, chained up anymore me, twist the blade in my flesh <laughs> Break your bones against my body. I want a real challenge this time. Jeez, what a masochist, bro. God we damn. Don't get that close. She'll kill us in the tight space, steel claw or not. Make her come to us, stand beyond her chains, and let her become frenzied. She'll break them. Then we run. It's just like that Tom and Jerry cartoon. You know the one where he's like, where the dog can't get him? I oh, really dang. don't like the sound of So this. smart. Classic, classic attack. It's the only way we live. Well, what are you waiting for? If we're going to do this right, you can't be scared. You need to want this as much as I do. I'm going to be real with you. I probably want it more. The more I talk to you, <laughs> the more I want to drive this into your fucking gut. So go on. Make the first move. Don't keep me waiting. Okay, here we go. Let's talk shit. Uh, let's talk a bit first. We can always fight when we're done, but I have questions. I want to know what happened after you killed me. Uh, not down here. If you want me, you'll have to come get me. Uh, if you want a good fight, if you really want to see me at my best, we need somewhere with more space. Why don't you want to be free? Why do you insist on fighting me to the death down here in the dark? I'm not fighting you. Ooh, I can just straight up fight her here, but that's stupid. Um. Uh, yeah, if you want me, you'd have to come get me. The princess scoffs. Oh, you're up to something tricky, aren't you? I mean, it was a cartoon from the 90s? When the fuck was Tom and Jerry made? Am I stupid? Bro, I'm about to Google that right fucking now. Me Hold on. But, <laughs> but I'm sick of waiting. I'm not going to let you give me another bad fight. I'm going to get what I want. Give me one second. I'm looking up Tom and Jerry. Desire in her oh, eyes, fuck. The princess oh, no, we gotta forward, go. Ignoring her forget it, forget it. Bend and snap. Okay. Well. Run. Uh, hold on. 1940? No, you're fucking lying to me. Ain't no fucking way Tom and Jerry is from the 1940s. What the fuck? Okay. <laughs> this is completely unrelated. What the fuck? Okay. Anyway, it's still ongoing. I had no idea they were still making Tom and Jerry. There's no fucking way. Dude, what the hell? I'm glad I said this stupid joke and then learned so much from it. What the fuck? Okay, forget Tom and Jerry. Let's get the fuck out of here. <laughs> Without hesitation, you turn back the way you came and scramble up the ledge towards the tunnel entrance. Oh, Jesus top, Christ. Hands desperately clawing at jagged stone, you glance back. The princess is right on your heels. 
She doesn't bother to scale the wall as you do, instead digging deep into the rock of the cliff face with her fingertips in her rabbit pursuit. Yeah, okay, we should have figured that out. Uh, also, holy crap, that is still so loud. Where are my, pre is it preferences? Sound volume, let's knock that down, please. I don't know if that's gonna help at all. Anywhere you go, I will follow. That's the plan, I'm hoping for Good. it, dumbass. You reach the ledge and hoist yourself up into the tunnel, the cabin door finally in sight, at once within your grasp and infinitely distant. Also, it is very suspicious that she didn't just break out of the chains and, and get the fuck out of here from before. You know what I mean? Like, that's that's a huge red flag. What is all of this for? Jesus. What's the point? You and I are always going to end in violence, so why bother to run? I know what I am. Why can't you be the same? Because I don't know what's happening. I don't know what's going on. Oh, man, fuck, little why am I bird, talking to this? Little bird, where do you think you're going? <laughs> we're almost there. Oh, God, she's going to catch me, dude. Almost. We're there when we're there. And we'll take the fight with us. Your skin hums tight with adrenaline as you burst through the cabin door and roll onto the grass. You glance back She's at the huge! cabin as the princess, singular in her desire to destroy you, explodes through the doorway. You are walking a dangerous path. If you waver once, it's all over. So get it right. Jesus Christ, she's fucking massive. Oh my God, that's a big bitch. Dude, freaking like, no wonder she fucking swept the floor with us. I'm surprised we even got a couple hits in. Jesus, fuck that is scary. There's nothing left to slow me down. Do you think this is better for you? Do you think this space gives you an edge? Then show me. Show me that you've been worth all the room you've taken up in my head. Oh, so you're thinking about me, eh? All right, well, we can, we can go that way. Hey, uh, how you doing? Do it. Be swift, strike true, be where she's not. Let your body move you. Mm, if only I could. Let's see here. You fell for my trap card. You activated my trap card. Uh, are you sure you want this? <laughs> You're free now. And out of here, I have the upper hand, but I don't want to fight. Uh, you activated my trap card? Oh, we'll see about that. Traps aren't real. <gasps> the only thing that's real is bloodshed. Bruh, she did not just say that, dude. You're gonna get so canceled on Twitter or X or whatever the fuck it's being called now. Blue Sky? Is that the new thing? Anyway. She charges, fully determined to end you in a single move. Left, now. As the princess strikes, your body swerves to the left. She overextends, <gasps> stumbling as her balance shifts unexpectedly. Look at that face. Oh, fuck. Oh, get her. Oh. Before you can finish the thought, you lash out, the blade slicing through her leg. She turns to swing again. Oh. Right. You move out of the way, but this time it's not quite as clean. You can feel a bruise already blooming where her elbow crashed into flesh. I mean, a bruise is preferable at this point. It's nothing. A scratch. Yes. Not even. It could be worse. And you managed to gift her another cut in return. I'll be damned. Even the narrator's just like, wait, bro's got this? What the hell? Is he him? We're actually going to pull this off, aren't we? <laughs> what the fuck? I love the confidence that they have given me. You just might. But don't let it get to your head. Not until it's over. Yes, finally. This is the hole I felt in my heart. This is what I've needed. This is what I've been missing. This is how it always needed to end. Both of us giving it our all, beating and bleeding each other to death. Calm down. <laughs> the two of you engage in a devastating flurry of blows, each of you wounding the other again and again. Well... I'm sure she can do way more damage. She's so. stronger, but you're faster. And the deeper the both of you fall into your lethal dance, the more your edge shines over hers. She's slowing down, blood pouring from wounds, splattering at her feet, leaving her weak and unsteady. She is getting fucked up, bro. How the fuck did I get that cut? Like, 
I got her t three times on the face. Like, I shouldn't even be aiming for the face, bro, honestly. More. Keep going. We can't stop now. Fuck, no, we you can't. Ooh! But this time she's waiting Aww. for you. She lets you sink the blade deep, trapping you in place long enough to wrap you in her impenetrable arms. You're slammed to the ground. Damn, a tie again, bro? I really gotta nothing. step up my fucking These game here. These are nothing to us. I don't know. But her gambit wasn't enough to close the gap. Oh. It wasn't enough to kill you. <gasps> she stares you down, coughing up a splash of blood as she gasps for breath. Yes. What you got to say now, <sighs> bitch? You've outplayed me, haven't you? I told you. You activated my trap card. Something feels wrong. Something. And? Then what happens? You activated my trap card. Now I'm gonna tap my mana for three red. Now I'm gonna uh, have uh, Charizard use flamethrower. Fuck, I didn't mean to do that. What the hell did I hit? Okay, I just hit pause. <laughs> oh, what? She inverted. Okay. A wide open field, lure the hulking, a hulking foe to advantage advantageous territory and win we did it dude is that the end of the game <laughs> but you do not have a chance to respond something has taken her away and it's left something else in her place she's gone where did she go not the fucking Should mirror again absolutely not i do not want to find her bro let her let her go again. why is it here why now uh i don't know where she went and I don't know how we'd even go looking for her. Fair. Uh, the narrator is gone. Ooh. I think I'm supposed to look into the mirror and approach the mirror. Uh, I don't what? even want to find her. She's gone. It's just us and that awful thing. And it's only the voice of the hero. It's like it's Oh, no, it's, it's all of us. Okay. Let's just stay still. Ooh, we could just stay still. The narrator is gone. He is. Does that mean the world ended? No, I slayed the princess! That's the fucking point of the game! It hasn't ended. We're still here. The world didn't end. We're still here. Hell Come yeah. on. We just need to keep going. That's the spirit. I think I'm supposed to look in the mirror. There's something dreadful about it. Yeah, no I, I don't shit. Think you should. <sighs> Fuck, dude. That thing reeks of death. If only I had a choice. Screw the mirror. We just need to find the princess. <laughs> uh, quit game? No, I'm just kidding. I'm begging you. Don't do this. It's my only option, brother. It is literally all I can do. The memory never scared you before. It's different now. It feels... I don't know. Final. I hope not. Two episodes and I beat it and like, not even like, what is it, like 40 minutes of total playtime? You approach the mirror. Gaze into your reflection. Ooh, do we actually get to see him? Oh, <gasps> no, he's a vampire. Ooh, interesting take. Uh, silence as you reach forward. They're gone, but the mirror remains. It's time for you to see what's in it. Okay. Oh, the body. It's you. It's you! It's me! Holy shit, I look... Uh, like a... Like Wendigo-ish? <laughs> okay. You're alone in a place that is empty. It is quiet here. Proceed to the cabin. What fucking cabin, brother? You are at the cabin. Jesus Christ, what the hell is going on? Is she all patched up? No way, dude. I'll be so pissed. Something finds me in the long quiet and brings me the gift of a fragile vessel. Huh? Bitch said, what? Dude, I have so many fucking questions. Holy shit. Attacker. Destroy your body. 
Oh, what the fuck? What are you? The gift of a fragile vessel? What is the... Is this the end of the world? Let her cook. I mean, uh, let's hear her out. Uh, do you know the narrator? Do you know the muffin man? Uh, no. Uh, are you what sent me to slay the princess? Are you what trapped me here? Oh. Is this our employer? <laughs> I don't even know if we're getting paid to do this. <laughs> uh, do you know about the worlds beyond this place? Are you the princess? Uh, do you know each other? Do we know each other? What happens now? Attack or destroy? Holy shit, I got so many questions. Let's start off with what the fuck you is, bro. I am solitary lights in an empty city. What are you? God damn it, you fucking vague dipshit. Solitary lights? What do you even mean, dude? What do you mean? Thoughts without connections. A dim and nascent network. I wish to be more. Okay. Don't we all? Uh, what do you think I am? Because I don't even fucking know. I think that you are like me. I don't know. Uh, the only person I can think of that's like you is that dude from uh, My Hero Academia. <laughs> we are oceans reduced to shallow creeks. Sure. Uh, the gift of a fragile vessel? Yes. Nerves and fibers to feel the worlds beyond. Perspectives to make my own. I have no idea what this bitch is saying, dude. This one remembers a spark lost in time, and she would stop at nothing to reclaim it. She will make for a burning heart. Okay, I'm ignoring what she's saying. Also, don't mind me putting my cursor right here. <laughs> <laughs> I'm literally just like putting it somewhere I can see it and it's like the best contrasting point. Um, um, uh, yeah. We're getting, Do not mourn yeah. her. She has finally remembered what she thought she'd lost. What the fuck does that mean? Dude, I have no idea what's happening. Is this the end of the world? How can the world have ended if we are talking? Yeah, that's what the other guys were saying, though. <laughs> but I don't know what's happening. Let her out of there? No, you keep her. You fucking... You chill. Do you know the narrator? You are the only thing I have ever known. Hey, baby. Okay. <laughs> hey. Uh, uh, oh, is that... Is that grooming? Ooh, yikes. Okay, we're backing up. Nothing comes here but us. I ain't coming here. Nope. We are, uh... Let, let me out of here, please. <laughs> uh, are you the one that sent me to slay the princess? Or are you what trapped me here? I have only just now stirred to consciousness. I could not have trapped you here. And I too yearn to be free. Okay. What? <laughs> Uh, do you know about the worlds beyond this place? I know only that they are. Okay, that's fair. Uh, are you the princess? She is part of me, and part of me is her. Well, I got a job to do. But were you all the, always the princess, or are you just making her a part of yourself now? You speak in circles. Does it matter where one thing begins and another ends? Bitch, you think what I'm saying is confusing? Eat my ass. Oh my god. Do we know each other, dude? Well, she's just gonna say, you're all I've ever known, Lamau. Uh, what happens now? Nothing, as we are. But I know that there are worlds beyond us, and that we are meant to reach them. Okay. There is no exit. Okay. But this vessel is a creature of perception. Aren't we she all? She can make you forget, if only you believe her to be able to. 
What? Bring me more perspectives so that I may be whole, and perhaps then we will know our freedom. Hold on, so... Are you asking me to kill more princesses in order to give you more memories to then find a way out of this place? Is that what you're getting at? I don't know. I feel so stupid, dude. I have no idea what's happening. Uh, okay. That's my only option. I should have attacked her while I had the chance. God damn it. Should have done that. Uh, <laughs> are you scared that I'll find a way to kill you? Uh, how much will I forget? How many pieces of you do I have to find? What if I don't <laughs> let you do this to me? Uh, I was sent to slay the princess to stop her from destroying the world. If I help you, is that what you're going to do too? Yeah, let's say it. You ask of things that cannot be done. To destroy is merely to reshape. To remote. Okay. But why do we keep our memories? Let it be. You're being semantic. <laughs> are you... What, what are you going to do if I help you? How can I know? I am flickers and something sprawling and unilluminated. Well, you're not being very convincing on... But I have no choice now. Because these are all just option dialogue options. Or, or like a flavor text, I guess. Aren't you scared that I'll find a way to kill you? How much do I forget? How many people? Oh, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, how often do I have to do this? More than you have found, but less than there are to find. I am infinite. The rest will find their own way home. Yeah. Fuck that answer. That was a shit answer. I'll find a way to kill you, I swear I to God. I have not lived. I am not afraid to die. Okay. <laughs> That's a pretty hard statement. <laughs> that goes pretty hard. How much will I forget? Everything. Until we meet again. Well then... Isn't that just like a... Loop? And what if I don't let you do this to me? Then we will be here forever. As we are now, unfinished, dry, hollow. <laughs> I'm not going back. <laughs> if you need time, <laughs> then I'll wait with you. <laughs> wait forever. That's hilarious. You are as I am now, and forever is a long time to remain undone. Yeah, I'm kind of regretting I that. I not you, but I know that I would return before forever was finished. That's an ominous statement. What textures will you weave for yourself to occupy forever? Will you place the images of you and I into a box for safekeeping? Probably not. I, I mean, honestly, like, whenever there's a, a story about, like, infinite time and and forever you know it's always like they just like straight up go crazy and forget humanity and just forget everything and and don't like have emotions anymore or anything if so you close that box will you become another you in another world an imaginary pattern repeating itself until it can no longer bear the weight of its hand-drawn cage sure we'll go you'll with that always come back to the box because you'll always want to know what it means to be you. I will be here waiting by your side until you're ready to return to mine. What? Did... Oh. <laughs> Did the game crash or... <laughs> <laughs> okay. You have returned to me. Bro, Though no. You were gone mere moments. I never left your side. 
What the fuck? It just immediately popped me back in. Dude, like, okay, I'm not gonna edit that because that was insane. I was actually just like, okay, I'll just wait for the game to load and then go back into the menu and everything. And, <laughs> and it's pulling a fucking Doki Doki Literature Club on me, bro. Come on. Damn, well, now I got no choice for sure. At least I got that achievement. Uh, yeah. Make me forget. She asks that I tell you to remember her. Well, that's kind of not the point, dumbass. You won't. Thank you. Everything goes dark and you die. Sick. Bring the eye of the needle to her. The hell does that mean? You're on a path in the woods. You'll know it when you and see it. And at the it. end of that path, the real Slay the cabin. Princess starts here. And in the basement of that cabin is a princess. Okay, dude. You're here to slay her. If you don't, it will be the end of the world. <laughs> Note you can skip previously seen dialogue by hitting tab on your keyboard or ry on your controller. I just kidding, I know. <laughs> okay. So it literally just starts over? Uh, fuck it. Seriously? You're just <laughs> going to turn around and leave? Do you even know where you're going? No. <laughs> uh, yeah, totally, bro. Uh, okay, fine. You're persistent. I'll go to the cabin and slay the princess. Ah! Uh, okay, fine. I'll go to the cabin and I'll talk to the princess. Maybe I'll slay her. Uh, maybe I won't. I guess we'll see. Nope. Yes, definitely know where I'm going. Uh, the only thing that matters is where I'm not going. The cabin. I'm not going to the cabin. I'm actually pretty okay with this world ending. I relish the coming of a new dawn beyond our own. Gonna go walk in the opposite direction now. Quietly continue down the path away from the cabin. This one seems a little too, uh, philosophical, in my opinion. I'm just gonna say nope. <laughs> Fine. I suppose you just quietly continue down the path away from the cabin. Cool. Good. What we're being asked to do here is wrong. Better to wash our hands of this whole situation than to take part in it. Uh, I don't know about that one. Ignore that annoying little voice. He doesn't know what he's talking about. <laughs> okay. That's strange. Motherfucker. Like this path also leads to the cabin. How convenient. Everything's back on track again. Maybe the world can still be saved after all. Turn around again, you moron. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, I'm going to the cabin. Sheesh, nah, go You're really go away. really keen on wasting everyone's time, aren't you? It's remarkably selfish, if you ask me. I've already outlined the stakes of the situation. If you don't do your job, everyone dies. Like, dies, dies. Forever. Hey man, you know, YouTube is about, you know, retention, and I get that. <laughs> and if people want to waste their time listening to my dumbass talk, that's on them. That's not on me, bro. And I love it. I love you. Uh, <laughs> I don't care, I'm not killing a princess. Good, maybe sh everyone should die. It's what they've been getting... That's what they get for dumping me in the woods and asking me to kill someone for them. You're not emotionally blackmailing me into doing this quietly, continually down the path. No, everyone should when die. When I said everyone, I meant everyone. That's a pretty large group to just condemn to death over a single princess. Yeah, but I ain't racist or nothing. Like, <laughs> I don't hate like a certain group of people. <laughs> and last I checked. You're part of everyone too, so if you think about it, walking up to that cabin and slaying her is really in your best interests as well. I hate everyone equally, brother. But fine, you turn around and trek back down the path you came. Oh, Jesus oh, you Christ. At You're at the cabin again. Now, I'm not normally one for superstition or astrology, but I have to say, it seems like the universe itself is doing its best to bring you to your fated confrontation with the princess. 
Uh, there's no fighting it is uh, there's no fighting this is there uh, I have I have to go into the cabin don't I fine oh yeah well I guess I start walking in a different direction again in fact I'm just gonna keep trekking through the wilderness until I find a plan right here Look at this place there's always a choice let me tell you right now that you're making the wrong one for pretty much everyone who's ever lived as well as for everyone who ever will Okay, I want to point out that at the beginning of this game, when you start it up, it says that there's no wrong choices. <laughs> so fuck you. And here we go. <laughs> As you trudge into the woods, something strange starts to happen. At first, it's little flickers out of the corner of your eyes. Glimpses of familiar wooden structures through the leaves. The hell? But as you focus oh my on God. your surroundings, you start to realize that those flickers weren't just a trick of light. Oh, the music's getting fucking weird, too. In every direction, oh God. there is a path and a cabin. And not just a cabin, THE cabin. An infinite fractal of paths and cabins desperately trying to draw you back to where you need to be. I wanna! I wanna! Wait, what's going on? Yeah, for real. But you're too stubborn for that, aren't you? It doesn't matter how many paths or cabins appear around you, you're just going to do whatever you can to shirk your responsibility because you care more about irritating me than you do about the fate of the world. This is some real Bioshocky, infinity shitty. You've doomed us all, you know that, right? But of course you do. Otherwise, you wouldn't just wander off into the forest in search of certain death. Fair. You lose track of just how long you spend aimlessly tromping through the wilderness, but it's not like any of that time spent lost in the woods really matters, because it isn't <laughs> long before the world ends and everyone dies. Oh, you were serious! <laughs> didn't- I, I, I'll be real, I didn't actually think, uh... Okay. You're on a path in the woods, and at the end of that huh. path is a cabin. And in the basement of that cabin is a princess. Okay. Oh no, look, is that a wall? Is that a wall just surrounding You're the here forest to now? Slay her. It'll be the end of the world, yes, yes, we know. Um. If I can't run away from the cabin, then I'm just staying here in the woods forever. Stay in the woods forever. Huh. Yeah, yeah, I get it. I'm going to the cabin. Uh, getting terrible sense of deja vu. Wait, hasn't this already happened? Okay, no. Are you kidding me? She actually into the world last time, didn't she? What the hell is she? Uh, oh, you bastard. You're in for it now. I'm wise to your tricks, but I died. The whole world ended. What am I doing here? Uh, those walls weren't here last time. You can't just force me to go to the cabin. Uh, lie. Yep. Okay. Heading to the cabin now, uh, where I'm definitely going to uh, slay the princess. Yeah, get him go to the cabin. Silently proceed to the cabin. Uh, if I can't run away, I'm just going to stay in here forever. You know, fuck it. Oh, that's clever. A little... Boring, though. I actually regret that because I do. I did want to talk about some of it's the other things, but oh well. Boring. Can we really do that? Can we really just do nothing? I mean, it's an option in the game. No, you can't just do nothing. You have to do something. I am doing something that is choosing to do nothing. All right. That so makes sense. Decided. Even if it's boring, we're going to do. Nothing. Forever. The Contrarian. That one's new. Congratulations. You continue to waste everyone's time and do nothing. Wait, can you still hear me? Everything's getting fuzzy. What the fuck? Where'd he go? What is that weird feeling? It's like I'm barely even here anymore. Bro, this... <laughs> this game's wild, dude. Like... 
like choice wise, I, I'm so surprised that this is going well, so it's far. Not nothing, that's for sure. Does that mean we messed up? Probably. I wouldn't put it past me. Okay, the world around you is unwound, its physical matter replaced by a textured nothing. You find yourself in the long quiet once again, memory returns. There is a distant rumbling, a sound of many sounds. Undulating pulses? Louder is something other comes close. Oh, uh, other is in capitalized, something other. Okay. You already know what dwells in the empty spaces. Ooh, now I'm the hands. Feelers probe across the fabric of reality. Extremities find your consciousness and wrap themselves around it. You are no longer alone. Confusion. Why are you here? I am unfinished. Resistance. Fingers drag claws across the glass surface of your soul. Jesus. Frustration. This vessel is full of you. It is useless to us if it doesn't bring more gifts. Force pushing against your will. No, you cannot go back. Not there. Regret. This world is broken beyond repair. We must weave something new. A, wag a wagging finger. There is only so much thread in this place. Do not waste it. I am o our only salvation. Oh. Oh, Jesus Christ. Turn your death to the path or face the consequences. Denial. You're on a path in the woods. And at the end of that path is a cabin, and in the basement of that cabin is a princess. You're here to slay her. If you don't, it will be the end of the world. Okay, he ain't lying. Uh... Okay, uh, I'm actually gonna... <laughs> oh, I can't actually leave this time. Okay, thanks for telling me what to do. Interesting. Okay, I think I'm gonna call it there for this episode. What a... What a fucking ride already, dude. Multiverse fucking... They're fucking with my computer. They're crashing my game just to fucking... <laughs> have me come back, god damn it. Oh, man. Good shit. I am so looking forward to killing more of these motherfuckers, dude. Let's go. I'll see you in the next one.